Well, there is nothing more fun than a red carpet runway to showcase great fashions. So why not a runway to showcase great rescues, as in dogs that have been rescued by amazing Suncoast organizations that are in need of loving forever homes. Mark Shambor from Canine Corral is here to help us coordinate this runway chaos. So Mark, we have so many great rescue organizations that um, take care of animals here on the Suncoast. Before we meet today's pet participants, you have some other animals and organizations to introduce us to. I do. There are a lot of good rescues. This is Canine Castaways. That's Rose. And uh, I took this from their website. She may be adopted, but remember, all of these dogs have, or all these rescues have more dogs mm -hmm. to be adopted. They're endless. This is a racing dog retirement project that, Aww. of course, is a greyhound. That's London. Oh. And Moon Racer <laughs> Rescue. That's a wonderful dog named Rudy. It looks like he's an outdoor dog. He smiles a lot. Yeah, Humane <laughs> Society Manatee County, that's Parks. And the Humane Society has a nice low-cost clinic that's relatively new. Oh. This is Bishop's Animal uh, Shelter, and that's Man. Man is an older Chihuahua who really needs a home. He's an, a wonderful dog. Joey, oh. that, he's got Senior. you written all over Yes, him. that yeah. dog has my eyes. <laughs> <laughs> and Mark, that, you make a great point that even if one of these dogs does get adopted, by the time someone calls, there are still Dozens of, of dogs for each one of the ones that we've seen that yes. needs a good home. We live in a world where there will always be a dog to be adopted. Yes. yes. All right, you actually um, get to work with a lot of these different organizations and their dogs. Tell us about your training offer for rescues. Well, what I've done for actually the last 10 years is I've offered a, pre a free training session to each dog that gets adopted within the first month. It gets them off to a good start. It kind of helps somebody with something that might be just really simple and uh, ultimately the goal is to not have the dog go back to the shelter. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, these, the people in the or rescue organizations, they do so much work and I don't think anybody really sees everything that goes to just in one dog mm -hmm. to get to one place. Oh, oh yeah. really that's a cute one. Well, this <laughs> is a great reason then to highlight six Suncoast rescue organizations and uh, they're all giving a pup in need a rescue red carpet moment. So are we ready? We're ready. All right, our first look today comes from Roxy. Welcome Roxy. Roxy is accompanied by Iris. Roxy comes to us from Satchel's Last Resort. She's a two-year-old black lab mix. Roxy describes herself as a good girl. <laughs> her friends describe her as active and playful. Roxy lived with a family with five children and one other dog. She's looking for an active family, hopefully with a fenced ah. yard, preferably oh. with other dogs. As you can see, Roxy she, is friendly. She's playing up to the judge. Yes, yes. She is. <laughs> she's looking for the votes. I think she's That's getting right. them. Right. She's oh. single and looking. So a so green friendly. coat. Yes, and she has eyes. dressed in a statement piece. If you can see, that leash says, adopt me. Oh. And the tail is going. Yes. Oh, she's a heartbreaker. Thank you, Roxy. <laughs> she went right down the road. <laughs> she did. Now Roxy. let's meet Lola. Oh. Lola is accompanied by Sherry. Lola comes to us from Underdog Rescue. They specialize in rescuing small breeds. Oh. Lola's a four-year-old Shih Tzu. She has a medium energy level. That is, she loves to fetch, but she also loves to cuddle. She oh. looks like me she with that nose. She, she does like have your kind of look. Nose. She looks like a perfect dog for you. <laughs> really, really yes, Linda, she now. came from a shelter. <laughs> She's perfect for a family in a home, of course, but also good for a family that might be in an apartment or a condo. Lola is trying to bridge the gap between dogs and cats. She's great with cats. She's also great with kids and with other pets after a proper introduction. Oh. Thank you, yeah. Lola. And Very well behaved. And she doesn't judge. Yes. manners. Oh, uh, Lola is buttering up the judges. <laughs> now we're going to meet another Lola. This Lola is accompanied by Jessica. Lola Aww. comes to us from Nate's Honor Animal Aww. Rescue. Nate's specializes in rescuing homeless animals. Lola is a one and a half year old Chihuahua. She has a mellow temperament and a sweet charm. She does well with most families and Lola is great with kids. Lola is best suited for a retired couple or someone of moderate activity level. Oh. Lola needs lots of love and she has lots to give. And you have a cute little She wants to us. be a little princess. Look at those she ears. Hi. She's so, so proper. She's so fancy. Lola's wearing Pantone's color of the year. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Lola. Now we're gonna meet Jules. Ah. Jules is accompanied by Jill. Jules comes from Sarasota County Animal Services. 
Jules is a two-year-old black mouth cur. As you can see, Jules loves to have fun. <laughs> she may be a stray, but oh, she is. Oh, look at that tail go. She's a leg in her booty. <laughs> she might be a stray, but she is Shake focused it, on her future. Shake it, girl. <laughs> <laughs> this, has a, this dog you has show. a career. Jules likes to dance ah. and shimmy. Love Jules, go. Shake it, girl. Jules is looking for a semi-active family. <laughs> Jules loves to <laughs> swim. Oh, what she will get along with kids over 10 with an introduction and Jules likes other dogs. We like ah. Jules likes TV too. Yeah, she does. She <laughs> Thank you, shake Jules. It. Shake we it, like girl. you, Jules. What a sweetie. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's great. Now we're gonna meet Lilo. Here Come on comes. down. Lilo is accompanied by Christina. Hi, Lilo. She comes from Thank Unity Herding Hi, Farms. Lilo. They specialize in rescuing herding dogs. Oh. She is a one-year-old Australian cattle dog. Oh, smart. Lilo's friends mm -hmm. describe her as easygoing and a little submissive. <laughs> <laughs> Lilo was a stray coming to us from Miami. Lilo's looking for a moderately active family. The thing is, Lilo likes having a job she or an activity to do. Lilo is good with older children, and she's great with other dogs. Maybe she could help clean up. She, can <laughs> she probably could. Right. She can hurt she, us. She yes. Like if we could give her a job, we've opened Thank it. you, Lilo. <laughs> Bye, sweetheart. And now we're going to meet our first kitten of the runway today. Oh. Meet yes. Gumby. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Gumby is a sweet little boy accompanied by Pam. <laughs> Gumby comes from Royal Pet Rescue. Gumby is only 10 weeks old. Oh. Gumby has just been microchipped. Gumby has a friendly temperament. Gumby was a stray family coming to us from out east in Arcadia. Gumby's good for any family, good with kids with an introduction, and good with pets with a polite and proper introduction. <laughs> oh, she's Thank so you, she's Gumby. Gumby's ready to go. Gumby's oh, and Gumby dogs. is neutered and ready to go. That's our first neutering on the red carpet. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, Gumby. And thank you to Mark from Canine Corral for all of our wonderful animals and all of our great animal services that we have here on the Sun Coast. If you want any more information about any of these animals or any of your pet needs, including daycare and boarding and the training that K9 Corral is offering, you can go to their website, K9CorralSRQ.com. Coming up next, a unique world premiere from Florida Studio Theater.